Welcome to Six Figs, I'm Kyle, and in today's video, I'm coming at you from Shibuya, Tokyo, Japan, and we're talking about the internet computer, everything from the ecosystem news to the charts. We have some banger tweets in today's video, and one of them is Dominic Williams saying that he's been quiet for a bit. If you remember, about a month ago, he hinted at a major release coming towards the end of October. What's he talking about? It's probably this major evolution to AI on the IC. And this is extremely bullish, folks, because I've got a, a feeling that Definity will not disappoint on this. They rarely do. So with 11 days left in October, uh, we still have some time to wait to see what this is, but I got a feeling that this is gonna be an absolute banger. Definity says DeFi Llama list ICP with nine of the 15 most active DAOs globally. Now this is absolutely huge because ICP is ranked number 26 in the entire cryptoverse and they have captured this much of the active DAOs globally. Extremely bullish to even think about that, especially where it sits in the market cap and in the rankings. Obviously they've got the best tech, but we don't have the market cap that Avalanche, that Solana has. So hopefully with this AI announcement, this will help boost uh, ICP into the top 10, top 15, and we can go from there. It'd be nice if we could go up to the top five. Uh, Andrew from Definity says it happened. More ICP has been burned post-Bob than pre-Bob. Now this is very important because ICP is deflationary in the sense that the more people that are using the chain, the more ICP that gets burned. And folks, this is exactly why we need all hands on deck when it comes to building and things like that. Now, I've seen a lot of chatter here about KongSwap, which we're gonna be talking about in just a second, but I just wanted to shine a light on some of these other great projects that you're seeing here. Uh, remember, folks, we shouldn't be ragging on all these projects that want to build on the Internet computer. We need them. If they only burn one ICP per day, we still need them. If they burn 100 ICP or 1,000 ICP a day, we need them. We can't have any stones unturned. We need ICP users, and we need them bad. So with that said, there is an NNS proposal for KongSwap which is now live and I will pin this in the comments and the description so you can go and vote on it. We would appreciate your support. I've been very transparent about being an advisor to KongSwap since day one, before the thing even launched. It, founders fully docs, they've got a white paper, everything's very transparent, folks, and it's all laid out for you right in the Definity forms, which I will also post a link to this as well but there's everything anybody could ask for as far as information goes. And really there's been some great Q and A down towards the bottom, which I would encourage you to read. Uh, so there is a proposal right now, 133442, which is live for about the next day and a half or somewhere in there. And KongSwap is ab absolutely killing it, almost 49 to one. So there's a lot of support out there for KongSwap. In fact, a lot of people are comparing KongSwap, which is a month old, maybe less than a month old, to already existing applications that have been around for years. And KongSwap is on par and faster. And guess what? We haven't had any failed transactions in the last 7,000 transactions. So let that sink in for a second. Nobody's here to try to shut down any other applications. We're all growing together. We're all limbs of the same tree known as the internet computer. We need to thrive together, right? Um, so yeah, check this out and vote and we'd appreciate your support. Uh, so hopefully it's gonna go through, uh, but getting on to the price action, Internet computer folks is chilling at a solid $7.98. This seems to be quite the sweet spot for ICP the last couple months, but we're down 2% on the day, up 160% on the year roughly. Looking at the daily chart here, guys, and we've got this beautiful uh, pitchfork that I've drawn up for you. We've got 
a symmetrical triangle squeeze that is happening here. And we are seeing this price really since June just trade sideways. And we're seeing a squeeze happen. And we're seeing the highs getting lower and we're seeing the lows getting higher. And we're seeing it really consolidate. So this is the buyers and selling basically headbutting over price action. Now we do have a Fibonacci time sequence that did occur on October 13th, somewhere in there. And hopefully that's marking the local bottom because if ICP is able to follow this pitchfork, we're gonna see some of these higher $40, $50 prices maybe by this spring, so within the next six months, which would be really cool. Um, if you see ICP trading above about $9.50, somewhere in that neighborhood, we've probably broken out of this symmetrical triangle and hopefully are heading to the upside. Uh, so folks, with that said, I will try to create some more videos over the next week, uh, but it's been difficult because I've been traveling through Asia and I'm in Bank or at Bangkok. I'm in uh, Tokyo right now. Uh, so I love you all and we'll see you guys on the next video.